Hey guys, welcome back to Spelunky! And after that milestone video that we recorded last time, in which we beat Olmec, today... Today, my friends, we're gonna start the serious and full hardcore run-through, starting at the mines, going all the way to either Olmec again, or hell, if we manage to pick up all the items that we require on our way, so... Let's let's stop the stupid talking like prep talk whatever the fuck today We're just gonna jump in and have a good time and see where this takes us Because this now is a completely different story from just hey Let's open up the shortcut and use that shortcut to make it very easy for us um, Because I mean when, when we did that when we just did uh, the the individual world we only then had to worry about that world and it's like gimmicks like individually we didn't have to like I don't know apply this whole grand scale to everything and had to plan everything ahead um, and that is totally what we'll have to do today because there's a few things we really do want to pick up and we really should pick up and I will definitely try my best to make that happen but uh, as you might imagine, as with everything in Spelunky, it's not really the most easy thing to do, unfortunately. So, the first thing that we really do want is uh, the Ujet Eye. So, the, guy, the thing, the guy, I almost said. The thing you get by... Do I want to go over there? I feel like I kind of do. Uh, the thing you get by opening up the chest using the key somewhere in the mines. Oh, the damsel, I'd so love that damsel. So, I don't know, on one of these upcoming floors there's gonna be a key and a chest and we're gonna get the Ujet Eye. Why the Ujet Eye, you ask? Uh, in a very nice way because that kind of rhymes. Um, well, the main reason for that is because we would like to go to the black market on um, on the jungle, on one of the, one of the jungle floors. I should say, and uh, yeah, that is easy, most easily found by using the Ujet Eye. You can find it without the Ujet Eye, that is totally possible, um, but not very likely because you then have to, uh, I don't know, I don't fucking know how to describe it. I might just do that once we get to it, because that is going to make this very, very, very easy for me to describe right now. With uh, the English that I have and the vocabulary that I have, that is almost fucking impossible. <laughs> Not so much. I just don't want to fucking focus on that too much right now. But yeah, so Black Market is our next stop, and that is mainly our next stop because we would like to get... Um, let me think about this one real quick. That is a no-brainer. Uh, simply because we want to get the Ankh. And the Ankh then does additional shit that I will probably not talk about just yet because that's still a long, long time in the future. And I almost burped there uh, in case you were wondering why my voice started sounding very, very weird. Um, we're not gonna do this. Instead, whip the thing, obtain literally nothing, kill Snake, get her gold. Do you guys also have that? I think I've already uh, talked about this in my Resident Evil remake for the GameCube playthrough. And that was a weird way of saying that. I, I did realize that <laughs> halfway through. But yeah, in that playthrough I already kind of talked about how, for me, snakes are always female. I don't know. Like, whenever I say, well, blah, 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 we're gonna kill uh, the snake so we can get her treasure I don't I don't know why that is is that the same for you because that totally is the same for me every single time I don't know I don't know if that's just me being German and that is not like now some poor excuse that doesn't really have any um, background because actually the word for snake in German um, is considered to be female so, so the way it is for us, the articles, so you're the, if you're from either, like, I don't know, an English-speaking country, to make it easy for myself. Um, your the is, uh, for us, three different things, and that depends on the gender of the word, and the, oh god, 
Oh shit, I- oh fucking hell. <laughs> that was not good damage there. I mean, is damage ever good? Probably not. Um... But yeah, so, that, so that's probably why, because it's die Schlange, so D being the, the German uh, female version of the, I don't know, just some, some quick German lessons here, live on camera, why don't we do that while we explore some mines, what better context could there possibly be, and we're now on the fourth floor of the mines, which is awesome. We don't have the Ujet Eye yet, though, so that is something we really gotta pay attention to now. Because we totally do want that. And I can't believe I killed that spider. The dangly spider, um, at least. Using uh, that rock. Oh, and now that rock is gone. And I'm kind of a little bit scared about this, uh, but it worked out for us. Awesome. Okay, that's gonna kill that bitch. We're gonna get the white sticky, white stuff off of her. Is there anything over here that we could potentially use? Um, well, the gold. The gold is all I want from that situation. Alright, so that crate is definitely something I would like to invest time in. Um, the snake will kill, like, obliterate almost. And then there's a bat coming for us and we can just get rid of her using, um stone once again notice how I said her I don't know that often puts me off a little because then I'm like is that like understandable for international viewers that I say her because once again that's another word that functions like that I don't know I would very much like some clarification on that by you my lovely viewers and I really do hope that you're still enjoying the series because I really am especially since uh I mean, like, I was sick, you might have, might have realized that, by either the video I uploaded or just me not uploading anything, uh, like, awesome <laughs> in the last few days. And yeah, I don't know, it now feels great to go back to Spelunky and not lay in my bed and be miserable about, oh, fuck, oh, that was dumb fucking damage, sorry for that. And, I don't know, that was dumb damage. Okay, damsel, I do want you, and the, the, the fact the fact that the key is here, that's what I meant to, or that's how I meant to phrase it, um, is really good, because now we can potentially get the Ujet Eye. So I will have her maybe not sit there, because that's fucking stupid, actually. Instead, I mean, it's maybe not that stupid. Let's just do this. She's gonna live through that. Now we're gonna have to take care of the bat, but that is okay. I'm... Uh, okay, there we go. Don't die. Instead, go to exit. Destroy pot. Kill snake. Oh no, that is the worst thing that could have happened. Oh my god, okay. Get the key. Get the key. Get the key. Open thing. Get Ujet Eye. Leave floor. Oh, okay. I felt like that was a good way of dealing with that. I almost pissed my pants, but... I'm still here, and my pants are still dry, so we can all be happy now, and carry on with things. So, do I want to bomb this? Maybe, in the future. Right now? No, no, no. We're not going to do that, because we could really totally need more bomb bombs. There we go. Stupid tree, trying to mess with my sentence. Um... In a way that totally should not have messed with my sentence, but okay, stupid skeleton is an easy task for me, for Lord Thor. L lord is, he's not a lord, like he's very far from, is it, what is he even? I'm not too familiar with Thor as a, a, like, comic book character. I mean, I know that he has the fucking hammer and shit. And he's, he's played by that one guy in the Avengers, but... Still, like, what's what's his deal? I'm not really too familiar with him. Like, he's always been kind of like one of the more weird comic book, like, like superhero character dudes. I don't know why that is. I mean, I might <laughs> there might be some of you out there that actually like adore him and, and the character that is Thor. But I don't know. For me, it's always been kind of weird, especially like 
You know how in the Avengers everything turns like really like batshit crazy with like aliens and portals and other dimensions and I don't know. Stuff like that has always been kind of weird to me. I always liked the the more, I don't know, grounded characters? I don't know if that's um, a proper way of, of labeling that. Like Batman, I don't know. There's nothing like too fantasy-ish about him. So where is that stupid black market? It's on here, and I want to go to it, but I can, for the life of me, figure out where it is. It's almost like... It's not down... Mm, let's just check with the rope. I, I don't know where it is. Okay, it's like right underneath this, and we're gonna have to spend our last bomb to access it, which I hate. But we're gonna do it, because we kind of have to. And we might be able to- No! Oh, come on! That was so unnecessary damage. Jesus. But I was trying to say that we might be able to pick up some additional bombs in the black market, which would be more than nice. And yeah, welcome to the black market! So, now, once again, to go back to describing how difficult it is to get to the black market without the Ujet Eye. Like, in a situation like that, the one that we just had, there's no way for you to see that the black market is there. Sometimes, depending on the layout, you might be able to glimpse a little bit of, like, a leafy, I don't know, edge that then marks the, the entrance to the black market, but that doesn't happen too often and is actually kind of really dangerous. Well, like, dangerous in the sense that you don't find it and then miss out on quite a few items. So, we'll kill this guy. And the problem that we have run into now is simply the fact that uh, we don't have enough money to buy the Ankh. Because you need 50,000 for that. And I don't really see myself getting another, like, 16,000 here. I mean, we can definitely check this place out a little bit more and at least give it a try. <clears throat> Sorry for that. Jesus, that was something weird happening in my throat. But yeah, that might not happen. I might have to then go back to killing these guys. Oh, shit. Okay, that was probably a good way, but also a dangerous way. Like that, we can just kill. Okay. And yeah, I don't, I don't think that this is now going to happen here. We might definitely... Yeah, we will have to kill the guys. I really do want the Ankh. I could just leave and carry on like the standard way. But I mean, I mean what, what's the fun in that? Killing them is much more exciting. Um, also much more dangerous, don't get me wrong. It's probably the most dangerous thing you can do. Mm, and it's not really the best setup for it, so I'm not exactly sure how to tackle this whole situation now. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, I gotta be fast. I gotta be really fast, though, because... Okay, we're just gonna go here. Oh, I don't have a bomb. Okay, we're gonna have to be quick now. This is super dangerous. Okay, just get over here. Jump up. Don't get hit by guys. Have them all fall down so you can take care of them at a later point in time. Fall down, man. Don't jump up to where I am. Okay. <laughs> Fucking danger, I'm so scared. Um, because they can totally kill you with one shot. Come on, man, and now this ghost is... Yeah, I'm dead. <laughs> that was to, ex to be expected. But that's not too bad, because we can now very, very nicely fit another run inside this episode. Let's just do a quick restart. And try that whole thing again. But yeah, this is now basically how it might very easily go in the upcoming episodes. Because it's not a very easy thing, a very easy mission that I'm on right now. Dealing with all that stuff and getting the Ankh is not really too easy. But um, one thing I definitely now should pay more attention to is just the amount of gold I have. And tr definitely try much harder to have 50,000 by the time we get to the black market. If we even get to the black, oh god, black market. So, this. I don't have anything to chuck down there, 
Azazen a rope, so we'll just do that. I guess it triggered already, which now upsets me greatly. And I'm 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 not happy about that, but Ah uh, two bombs. That's two bombs. But when we really think about it oh god, sorry for that. I should stop eating before I record. That usually fucks me up an awful lot. I don't know. How about rope? Mmm, I mean I'm more comfortable with spending ropes. But steel. Can I chuck a bomb right where that spike is? Okay, that totally worked. That's totally gonna allow us to go down there. We're gonna have to use another rope to get back up. But still, there might be something amazing in here. So let's just get rid of that stone. And there's bombs in there, so I guess that kinda did not really pay out, but hey. At least something, at least we tried, right? So let's leave this floor, I think that was the first one if I'm not mistaken here. I'm not 100% sure though. Was this the first one? It almost definitely, yeah, okay. So we now have six bombs, a lack of ropes, um, five health, which is awesome. Uh, but no items and not really as much money as I would like. So, we'll try to work on all of those things right about now. What about those bats? That is a fucked up situation I got myself in. Okay. Let's just wait for them. Jump. No! Come on. Unnecessary damage. Once again. Like a scrub. Okay. We'll just go down here. Is that a snake pit? That is a snake pit. And that could mean great things right here, right now. I don't know if I've ever shown off snake pit but those fuckers are seriously awesome okay now let's just try to I want that gold bar mm, okay let's not get that gold bar instead I'm um, focused on surviving here because it's actually quite dangerous oh my god of course right as I say that I almost kill myself but we're still alive we're gonna get oh god <laughs> come on man work on your platforming we're gonna okay that is good I can kill him and now we're gonna go back down, kill all these snakes. Uh, okay. And now the cool thing about snake pits is that there is actually a magnificent item at the bottom of each one. You can blow the shit up and get the matic, which once again, I'm not too sure if I've ever shown that thing to you guys. I don't know, I'm really fucking weird when it comes to that. I always forget what kind of stuff I did in previous episodes, which I guess should not really be happening. Okay, that bat I don't like, let's... Okay, there we go. Now, oh, I can't... Oh. How are we gonna do this? I want that damsel. Like, I really fucking want that damsel. I don't... I'm not comfortable with using another rope, though. Oh, we're gonna have to, because I also want that crate over to the right there so we'll drop her off go over here blow that shit up um, I guess I could have used the matic as well doesn't really matter anymore and there's ropes in there so that was actually kind of good that totally was worth it oh and that spider I also do want to kill what's the best way of doing this probably the best way is getting the matic and not spending more bombs than necessary. Oh, uh, that is so shit. That is so shit. Okay, we're just gonna leave. I'm not gonna fuck with that ghost anymore. Um, yeah, we're gonna take the Matic with us. That is such a good item. Um, I realized that I'd never explained it, but you can just break shit with it. It's eventually gonna break on you, which is unfortunate, but uh, a lot of money to be had if used correctly, so... Oh, come on. There we go. Um, that is kind of a fucked up situation. But I guess this kind of works to get out of it. Um, we'll just go down here, pick up some additional gold. Keep in mind, Ujet Eye is something we want. And as a result of that, the Ankh in the black market. So we need 50,000 for that. Get out of there. Okay. So as soon 
as we have the Ujet Eye. I will then also start mining stuff with uh, with the Matic, because then, as you might remember, I, I have definitely explained this in a previous episode, you can see gems inside the walls once you have the Ujet Eye. So the teleporter thing we don't want, let's just drop off, or maybe not drop off the Matic instead. Use that to make this much easier for us. Break pot, obtain sapphire. I think that was. Is that a sapphire? I don't know. I'm not. I'm not too educated on on those gems. Let's see. Yeah, that's definitely a sapphire. Ruby, sapphire, emerald, and stuff like that, right? And there's like diamonds too, which are very rare in this game. And we'll kill that. Almost as rare as like a, I don't know, like shiny Pikachu in Pokemon. So we'll pick up that Matic. Go, don't kill. Oh, okay. Because those do two damage to you, and that is shit. So I should probably, like, do something like this. Okay, very good. Much better. As you can already see, I'm getting better at Spelunky. I know it's hard to believe, but it's actually happening. At least I like to think so. So, that bat, I hate. Let's just whip it. Okay, there we go. Uh, whipping stuff was so hard when I first started playing this game. Like, just timing all of that was just seriously fucked up. Is this another snake bit? If so, we're probably the luckiest, luck, luckiest, luckiest, Jesus, person alive. Um, because that could mean another Matic and I could go fucking crazy with the one we already have. Um, but let's not get too cocky because that... Does not okay. It is the case, though. It is the case. Um, so this becomes a very interesting situation now, because we could totally mine a lot of stuff and make absolutely magnificent things happen for us. At the same time, though, there's a time limit, so um, the ghost could come and fuck us up. But for now, oh, that's not even an altar. I was thinking that this was an altar, and I could just uh. Oh god, okay. Let's let's get out of here actually. And I could just like sacrifice this damsel at her her him? I don't know. At it. There we go. That's probably the best one to use for that one. Uh and that is seriously fucked up. I am not really digging this situation. But I will be in the second once I use my Matic for stuff like that. So Um there we go. There we go. Kill that. Don't have her get killed by Snake of Doom. Seriously, though. And there's the, the second Matic. We're gonna just free it. Ju just so that we have it. Available to... Uh, come on. Break that block. Break that block. Mine for gems. Because that is something we definitely want to do now. Also, I should try to find the exit before we then have the ghost chasing us. And uh, that's not how I wanted to do that. Instead, here we go. Now... Get damsel. Oh, he's coming from. Oh my god. I'm just gonna have to leave. I'm gonna have to leave the Maddox behind. No! It sucks. I hate it. I hate it so much, but I did not want to risk it there. So instead, I'm gonna kill mon Not kill monkey. Kill monkey. Good. Kill snail. Wait for frog and kill frog. There we go. Get crate. Parachute. Uh, decent. And that guy is gonna kill himself, which is awesome. Now we're just gonna have to be careful with PD Piranha over here. Oh, why don't we just whip him, actually? And proceed. So, next step, Black Market. You all know that, and I can't wait to actually find it, because we do have the money to make this stuff happen in that. And also, if you find an idol on the jungle, get it. Because it's like the fucking easiest thing. Easiest idol to get. Um, okay, kill him. Evade. Oh, there, the black market is here. That is awesome. That is so good. I want to fucking kill him. Because I don't want him to fuck my game up. Come on, man. Ugh, so scary. Kill frog. Okay, don't kill him that way, it seems. 
Oh my god, it's so scary. Everything just... It's so scary. <laughs> Bomb this, because I don't... No! Oh, come on! Really? Now we just angered all the shopkeepers again? You've got to be kidding me. Okay. Well, we don't need the 50,000 anymore. <laughs> but we're gonna go to the black market. Most definitely we are. Shit! I hate everything about this. Okay. Well, let's just screw that idol. Since we don't need the 50,000 anymore, I'm just gonna worry about damsel furt. Oh god, okay. Okay, well, she is just, she's still alive, which is <laughs> amazing if you ask me, but... Um, also... A goddamn miracle. Now, where's that black market? It was definitely around here. Or was it maybe up here somewhere? There was a black market, though. Right? Right? Is it down? Is it up? Is it even? Maybe, maybe it was up. I know I saw it somewhere. Ah, oh, that was my last rope too. Wasn't it somewhere when I was like, oh. Okay, now it's blinking. So maybe it is actually down there somewhere. And now we have to worry about the ghost. This is fucked up. Where is it? What the fuck? How is he fucking damaging me? Oh god, and now that guy is coming and I jumped straight into the ghost. Well guys, a shit run, but I hope that you still enjoyed this episode. Um, we definitely made some progress, like we're now more comfortable and familiar with all this stuff. And very soon we'll get further and further and eventually make it to Olmec again. And then maybe make it to Hell somewhere in the future. And, uh, yeah, I hope you're still enjoying this series. I will see you next time. <sighs> and then we're gonna go spelunking again, so... Until then, guys.